What's up, everybody? Charles, LA Amsha 2011. That was Noel playing guitar. That's Sean. And we're at Sir Amps, and we're checking out some uh, new cool sh stuff. Uh, among them, the Badger 35. And uh, it's a pretty cool little amp, man. What you got going with this? You told me it's the the old Badger 18's big brother? Yeah, absolutely. Cousin. It's, uh, well, it, it's definitely a big brother. It, it's based on the same circuit. Uh, the original 18 watt has two EL84 tubes. This one has four. Um, initially, when, uh, when we released the Badger 30 watt, we didn't, we didn't initially want to just uh, put out the same amp. So we voiced it a little bit differently. Uh, the 30 watt is based on EL34s. But people just wanted more Badger, more Badger. And uh, a lot of people really loved the 18 watt and really needed something a little bit bigger to play with those really hard hitting drummers or big bands. So uh, we said, okay, so let's do it in a bigger format, you know? And, uh, and so, yeah, we're, we're showing the, the new 35. Mm -hmm. And the Badger series uh, will definitely continue in the future. We've got more, uh, more plans for, for future Badger amps, and uh, they're just going to keep getting uh, bigger and better. Any unexpected surprises as you developed this, uh, bumping up in power, anything different in the, uh, in the sounds you were getting out of the 35? You know, John just spent a lot of time making sure that, uh, that it was right and, and was a, a real similar amp to the 18, you know, because uh, initially that's what the 30 started as, you know, but as he got more and more into it, he just, he, he found that it would be better if he voiced it a little bit differently, but... The 35, the goal was to really just do a, a bigger version of the 18 for those guys that needed it. Yeah. Any kind of, any specific type of player you find gravitating towards this or have in mind? Well, there's only a couple people that own one so far. Uh, the first would be a uh, musician and super producer John Shanks, who was here yesterday saying that he just used it on uh, some tracks uh, the previous night. So, uh, so, f uh, so far it's only in the hands of a couple of people. But uh, we're just starting to make them. We've made a couple on a custom basis, and we're having chassis built now. So uh, you'll be seeing them at our uh, Sir retailers uh, real soon. All right. Noel, you want to give us a Sunday brunch taste of Badger? I'll give it a shot. <laughs> The great thing about the Badger series is that it has the built-in uh, power scaling uh, license from London Power, so you could bring the wattage down to like half a watt and still get the same same tone and same feel that you get, you know, with it cranked up. So uh, yeah, we'll, we'll bring the gain up to like eight. <laughs> City. Cool. Yes. Now, uh, Noel over here is playing a guitar. You want to tell me a little something about it, huh? Yeah, this is the, the, the Guthrie Govan signature model under the Rasmus brand. And uh, the Rasmus brand is uh, our introductory line in the Sur guitars. Uh, these guitars are initially built in China. And then they're shipped to the Sur factory where our custom shop guys completely disassemble each guitar, go over every aspect of it. Uh, you know, make any final tweaks or anything that need to be made. They do the final assembly setup. Uh, the guitars use our same custom fret wire, our pickups that are made in house. You know, the same Goto bridges that we use. Um, so they really have that sur playability and feel. But uh, we offer the the Rasmus at uh, they have a street price of nine ninety nine, and the Guthrie Govan is our is our uh, first signature model under the Rasmus brand, and this uh, this will have a street price of thirteen ninety nine. Sweet deal. Uh, where should people go if they want to find out more about uh, what you have going on on the guitar side and the amp side? www.surguitars s u h r guitars dot com. Just do what Sean says. All right. This is Charles for PremierGuitar.com.